new development on the HBO data breach, Indonesia deporting over 100 Chinese nationals, and a new study reveals company cybersecurity flaws. This is Hacker Daily for Friday, August 4th, 2017, and I'm your host, Marley Oxenholm. We have a new development on the HBO Network data breach. After reportedly having over one terabyte stolen from their servers, it turns out that the same hackers have launched their own website called WinterLeak and have actually uploaded all stolen data available for anyone to download it. The uploaded data includes unreleased episodes 3 and 4 of Game of Thrones, episodes 1 and 2 of an upcoming comedy series Barry, as well as files containing personal and financial information belonging to their executive vice president of legal affairs. In the meantime, we advise any viewers not to download the data uploaded by hackers since it is a punishable crime in most countries. And in other news, Indonesia is planning to deport 153 Chinese nationals that were arrested after alleged involvement in a multi-million dollar cyber fraud ring. The group had been based in several locations across Indonesia and contacted victims pretending to be Ch Chinese police or law officials and promised to help resolve their legal cases in return for immediate cash transfers. The criminal network included IT specialists to help retrieve information on victims and further develop communication for contacting them. The Chinese nationals were arrested in Jakarta, Bali, and the city of Surabaya. Police are currently investigating how several of the suspects were able to enter the archipelago without a valid passport. And lastly, a recent study from SANS Institute Research revealed that over 45% of global organizations claim that they didn't know the potential for financial losses associated with a cybersecurity incident. Report author Eric Cole stated, it is important to know that 38% of the respondents said that they do not have effective ways to detect insider attacks, meaning the real problem may be that organizations are not properly detecting insider threats, not that they're not happening. The study goes on to say that organizations should respond by understanding where their most critical data is held and who has access to it, before tightening access controls to only those who need it. Well, that's all I have for you guys today, and thank you for tuning in for your current InfoSec highlights at Hacker Daily. This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Follow us on Twitter, YouTube, and Facebook. We'll see you next time.